Hey everybody, Rich Lavelle with the Vacaville Baseball Barn and welcome back to part two of a three-part series on three core movements. First series or first part we talked about hips before the hands and today we want to talk about the plane of the bat on the plane of the pitch. And let me explain that just a little bit more in detail. The pitcher stands 10 inches above you in, in 90 foot fields, 10 inches above the, field, uh, the home plate. He's throwing on a downhill type trajectory and we're trying to get our bat on the same level. So not that we do a level swing, that's just crazy and almost impossible. Especially on low pitch, there's no way to get down here and do a level swing. So as we get into our technique and we start swinging, our bat is actually traveling in an upward plane on 99% of pitches. Obviously if it's a low and outside, a little different story. But let's talk about that pitch on the inside or middle inside. I want to get into the position where my bat is parallel here, but as I start swinging, it gets on plane back here, so I have a much better chance and longer area to be in the strike zone or be in the zone of the pitch. So the pitch is coming down at me at six to eight degrees roughly. I want my bat going somewhere between four and six degrees, maybe eight degrees, depending on, on the type of hitter that I am. So why is that so important? Again, it gives us a much greater area to make contact with the ball. Whether I'm a little bit late, I'm here, and I'm on plane with the ball, I may foul it off or hit it over to right field. If I hit it on contact on a middle pitch here, I'm going back up the middle. If I'm a little bit out in front, again, I can pull it a little bit left. But the reason why I'm able to do that and not constantly hit ground balls or pop-ups is because I'm staying and I'm hitting the middle part of the ball. If you have any other questions, follow some of our other videos, maybe give you a little better explanation. Check out part three on our next video of the three core movements.